The Queen's Beast. The Black Bull of Clarence. Silver Steeler here. Our first destination is going to be Cataract Falls, a different spot than previous videos. So you are here. So here we are, Cataract Falls, Indiana, a different section of the falls this time. And here we have the fifth in the series from the Queen's Beast, minted by the Royal Mint, the Black Bowl of Clarence. The design descended to the Queen through Edward IV. The shield shows the royal arms as they were borne by Edward IV and his brother Richard III, as well as all the sovereigns of the House of Lancaster and Tudor. Nice design. Doesn't fit in my top three, but I like it. I think all these Queen's Beasts have looked really, really nice. There's the Queen. By far, my favorite section of these falls is what you see in the background there like the amount of water cascading down. So why don't we go to our next location. Our second stop is once again to Mount Summit Lake. And here you are. And here we are once again overlooking Lake Summit. A little bit more information about the Queen's Beast plaster statues and where they reside today. After the coronation ceremony, they were taken to Hampton Court Palace, where they stood guard in the Great Hall. At that time, the palace was also home to the King's Beast of Henry VIII. And then they were taken to Windsor Castle, where they were put in storage. And they can be found today at the Canadian Museum of History in Quebec, Canada. So how about a little bit more information about Summit Lake State Park? It's located near a town called Newcastle, Indiana. That's East Central Indiana. It is the 19th State Park, and it became that in 1988. It covers 2,680 acres, 800 of which are the lake itself. Why don't we just listen to the waves for a little bit? On to the next location. Our third and final destination once again takes us to Cataract Falls, Indiana. Cataract Falls. Back at the first position, you are here. And here we are again at Cataract Falls. Further up the falls this time. They have two really nice scenic locations here. And so this is the first one, which I've already used in a number of these videos. And the second one has the large amount of water that can be seen falling down. Why don't we just sit back and listen to the falls for a little bit. I almost didn't want it to end, but it has to. Remember to like, subscribe, and all those other good things. I'll see you on the next video.